What's up, everybody? Um, just finished the first mission. Well, I guess it's the second mission in the new Sex game. And all of my augments got reset. And I had a handful of new, new points, Praxis points, to give myself. And I looked through my new ones. And this is what I decided on. I did just play the last game. And that definitely helped me choose, which I think is really important. Uh, I forget how many you get, like 14 or something, 12, maybe it was 12 points. Uh, first thing I did was upgrade my hacking to rank 3. There's a safe in this room where you uh, talk to this guy um, hidden behind a box and a vent shaft that you can go to. Um, rank 3 is going to let you be able to hack into that. I think it's going to be really important to get this to rank 5 as soon as possible. They only take one Praxis point each. But um, getting to rank 5 on your hacks early game is very, very important. Uh, the next thing I did was I did this new one. This is a new one that wasn't in the game before. Um, it's called the Micro Assembler. To enable this in the early game here, you have to disable one of your other ones that you're not using um, to have enough power for this. But what this does is allows you to break down weapons, ammo, and other items um, into weapon parts from the inventory. What's nice about this, I haven't used it yet, um, is the new crafting that you can do in this game to create things. Um, and you find weapon parts throughout the game. But what's real nice now is when you pick up a, a weapon in this game, and if it's the first time you've picked it up or you don't have one already in your inventory, it will go into your inventory. Say you pick up a, a, a machine pistol. Um, then you can break it down. Now normally if you still have that gun in your inventory and you pick up another, it just turns it into ammo. So I think, I haven't used it yet, but I think this is a good one to have early on because every guy you take out, you can take their gun and then break it down. Uh, normally you wouldn't be able to do anything with those guns because they just turn into a little bit of ammo. And I think this is going to be really useful early on um, to get those weapon parts. Um, the next thing I upgraded, I really, really like smart vision. Helps me find little secret things. Um, see, see enemies. I, I'm playing stealth. I try to stay stealthy, and uh, this is really important. There is some upgrades. This one lets you see through the walls at, at the items, not just the enemies. And the, these are battery consumption upgrades. Didn't do those yet, but I will. Um, let's see. What else did I go with? I went with strength upgrade. No, I did not. I went with inventory space I pick up it's tons an of stuff in every way so I did go with all my inventory space now you might want to hold off on one or two of these um, if you want something else that's more um, I don't know to something that you prefer so these are kind of preference but I like inventory space so I wanted those really quickly the next thing that's really important is this here I did not have enough points whereas if I was to do it again maybe I would get rid of this last point in my inventory space and put it here on being able to lift and throw heavy objects. There's a lot of areas you can't reach if you can't move them, the, the big boxes, and this is going to be my next point, is into the uh, lifting heavy objects. Um, what else did we go with? We went with jump high. Um, leg leg uh, cybernetic implant here. And this lets you jump high. Um, if you've been playing the game, this this new game, up until the point right now, you've already had the jump high act active as one of your implants. And it's going to feel weird going back to not having it. So I think this is um, a really important one to have. And that is what I chose. I think if I was to redo it again, the only thing I'd do differently would be able to um, move the heavy objects and maybe one less bar of inventory space. And because um, I could deal with the inventory space for now. And hopefully I don't find anything that I need to move by the time I get my next point. And yeah, so far this game has been awesome. Everything about it I've really, really enjoyed. Really like the new customization. Um, now that we can break things down too and craft things, it's really awesome. So let me know what you guys think uh, in the comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe on our YouTube if you haven't. We'll be playing this game. I'm not sure for how long, but definitely all of us at Streamer House will be playing this live on Twitch 24-7. Twitch TV slash Streamer House. And thanks again, guys, for watching.